San Diego police have now released surveillance pictures of these four people who are linked to a deadly beating in the gas lamp. 10 News reporter Jennifer Jensen is live downtown tonight and Jen, police grab these pictures of video taken nearby. Well, Atika, as we first reported on Sunday night, we were told that the Encore Champagne Bar here right behind me actually had surveillance video from that early morning attack. Well, now it appears that the police department has freeze framed some of those uh, some of that video to show you what these four people are looking look like. Homicide detectives want you to take a good look at these four people. Images from surveillance video taken in the gas lamp around 1 a.m. Sunday morning. They are screenshots of four people now being sought by San Diego police for their involvement in a brutal murder. Police say the two men in the center and this woman on the right are wanted for their physical involvement in the fight that killed 25-year-old Michael Beaver. This woman is wanted for questioning. As soon as we heard, it, it just all fell like a ton of bricks. You can see in the cell phone video how 5th and F Street was shut down for hours after Beaver was punched. His head hit the ground. He was leaving, you know, for, for someone else to help them out, which is what he did. And it turned out to just be wrong place, wrong time, and the worst situation. Only 10 News was invited Tuesday night as friends gathered at the Double Deuce Bar in the gas lamp for a fundraiser for Beaver, a Chula Vista resident and avid RC racing enthusiast. He was killed just feet away from the Encore Champagne Bar and Dining Room across the street. Beaver was no stranger to this area. He once worked at Maloney's Tavern just feet away from where he was attacked. He had stopped by to say hello to old friends with his brother and another man. Minutes later, he was killed. It just feels like we had one of the good ones taken. And that's why this is so hard. Police hope someone will recognize these four people in the video shots and come forward. And Crime Stoppers is now offering up to a $1,000 reward for any information leading to the arrest of these four. We're live here downtown. Jennifer Jensen, 10 News.